You know what I find funny? Uh, you guys somehow get to my videos before me, and I literally know what I'm scheduling and publishing them. That's how I know you guys are awesome. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much on likes and support. Keep it up if you want more of this game quickly. My goal is to do as much as I can each day, uh, every single day, until we finish it. Well, as long as, like, a meteorite doesn't hit my house, I should be able to do that. So, uh, you guys are awesome. Love you all. Now, let's get this. Alright, here we go, guys. Welcome back. I'm not sure if it's a brand new video or if I just said welcome back for no reason in the middle of a video. We'll find out. Alright, so this note we just saw said... I took a little break, by the way. That boss fight was definitely something. Uh, finish that item that was requested. Please deliver to the house, the red chimney, go to the caves... To the ruins, then down into the village. Yo, I love that it's like, oh, go to the caves and the ruins there. Let me hop out here. More gunpowder, I'll take it. I, you know, surprisingly, that fight wasn't too bad. Like, I thought it was going to be a lot harder. I was going to be... Like, when I first time I fought the mother in Resident Evil 7, it was like... Like, oh my god. When I got done, I was like, do I even have enough, like... I don't even know what to use there. I need, like, a crank or something. I remember it was like a war of attrition. That fight didn't feel that bad. Um, the entire game has kind of been like all about everything's in fours, you know? The three daughters and then Alcina, who we just took down. Those four. They kind of ruled that other castle area. And then, before all that, we had Heisenberg, Alcina, uh, the doll lady. I don't know if it's a lady or not. And then, the hunched over person. And then, we had Mother Miranda. It's like, and there's also been talk about, like, the four different areas of the village. So, I don't know. Maybe we're headed to the second area. Maybe, like, each one has a boss. And I, I just assume Lady, uh, Lady, Lady D was going to be, like, the main boss of the game or something. The way they kind of presented her and everything. <laughs> Guess I was wrong. Mm, nothing over here I can really use yet. There's going to be a point in the game when we come back here. Same for the early stages of the game. I don't quite know why we can't crank anything yet. When you go down here, you got to lower the bridge. Which I'm guessing we go through here. Go around. Lower this down once we get the crank. And then we can come over and use the crank again. I don't know. That's just my assumption. Uh, bolt cutters? Willing to test it out by shooting. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> in the caves. I didn't like the caves in Resident Evil 7 at all. Those uh, oily type monsters. I don't know what they were. Oh boy, water. Oh, nice little fish there. Can only imagine what's behind this area. All the secrets. Who was that? We call on thee within the endless dark to deliver us into fate's hands. As midnight moon rises on black wings, so we make the sacrifice and await the light at the end. In life and in as the midnight moon rises on black wings, we await the light at the end. In life and in death, glory to Mother Miranda. Hey, remember me? I almost died up at that castle. Tell me, what is going on around here? How can a man be almost dead? That's a question for the wise. You know what I mean. And I still haven't found Rose. Where did Mother Miranda take her? <laughs> You're too late! Or maybe almost too late. The child will be sacrificed, life for life. What kind of sick medieval shit is this? She's just a baby. The crests of the four bloodlines may open the path you seek. Will you please stop talking in riddles? I just want to find my daughter. It's only a riddle if you don't know the answer. <laughs> I 
Wait a second. That looks familiar. Hey, hey, wait! I like how she just shows up whenever. I thought that might have been Donna. I think that's the person's name. Hold on, what is this? Winged key, okay. So, we got the four houses. Okay. This one, it looks like, I'm guessing we already did. Heisenberg. Okay. Yeah, that's the other two. That's the other two people. So, I'm guessing there's four total bosses in the game, which will then unleash whatever this is. I have no idea. Either way, it's scary. All right. We'll look around again. So, who is Mother Miranda? What's her whole thing here? That is... Okay, this picture right here. The little circle around the person's head. That's what Mother Miranda has. Same as this picture. I don't know what that is, but... What that's... I mean, I'm guessing that means that's all her. Why wow, they all look up to her as well. I would assume Mother Miranda is the final boss of the game. I need to stop trying to guess and just let it, let it all happen. Let it all happen! Look for Rose is our primary objective anyways. And we haven't even seen Chris yet either, so I don't know when we're going to see him. I'm guessing we... If they've already got the baby, then that would mean that Chris either dropped off the baby and ran. I don't know. Is this ceremony site? The four different statues. Yep. Look at them toes. And hey, look at these toes. Are those look at those fingernails. Or not fingernails, they're toenails, I guess. Um, that's actually kind of crazy. Somebody hanging up there. Just what I like to see when I get to a brand new area. Uh, let's see what this does. Can only imagine. Pattern looks really familiar. Looks like an Umbrella Corporation logo, doesn't it? <laughs> Just in black and white. Dirty flask, nothing. I don't know. I have no idea. Stone. Yeah, I, I don't know. Let's just head this way. This has been such a great game. And I, I like that if we've... Let's say this has been a fourth so far. We had the prologue, you know, everything leading up to us getting to the castle. Now I can kind of see why it's called Village, because I thought maybe we're going to be in that one castle with the lady for a long time. But uh, it didn't happen that way. And I didn't know she's going to be the first boss either. I want to know how he changes guns so fast. Look at this. Oh my god. Man's got skills. Oh, wait a minute. This definitely has some Resident Evil 4 vibes a little bit. I like that you can constantly see everything in the background as well. The mountains, the immersion, everything. Oh boy. Now, I don't know what's more powerful. Oh boy. These guys are going to take a lot of shots. <laughs> I wanted to just kind of take them out quickly. Not trying to conserve too much ammo right now at this very moment. These enemies will surround you and it's just almost impossible to get away so i wanted to kind of make sure i don't quite take it easy with just using the like the other enemies were easy because you could just shoot them with the pistol and it's you know that's that but i don't know what these do yet <laughs> uh like i said second playthrough i'm gonna get them all if that is something you actually have to get for like an achievement or trophy this is, okay, this is what I was thinking. My exact theory was we get across, we come down here. Although it's not the exact same thing. We're going to eventually get a crank of some sort or a valve we put in there and twist, like a little handle. And it's going to lower that down and we can head back. Well, let's check down here. Hold on. Oh, we already did. Never mind. This area is just going to be... It's going to be rough, man. Now, that just looks like... I don't know. Let's look around. 
Rusted scrap, I'll take it. Only issue, it doesn't have any kind of... It doesn't say currently searching or completed or anything, so I'm going to have to just kind of go based off of... Just looking around. Hopefully I find everything I need. I did not realize that shooting those... Uh, I tried to get... Uh, I tried to get cute there. Whatever. At least they dropped something decent. Now, what is this stuff I'm... I see something, like, new being dropped. Uh, rusted scrap gunpowder. Yeah, it's not any of that. Could make some of these. Forgot I... Kinda low on those right now. I got 34,000 currency right now. Shotgun shells are probably going to be what I kind of focus on for right now. I feel like you only get three versus 15, so I'm thinking, okay, 15 shots on one of these guys. Yeah, it seems like a lot, but I'm still on top of the shotgun shells because these, these enemies, I think, need that. Granted, also, I could use a sniper rifle if I really felt like I could do it, you know. <laughs> we'll find out. Other side of this area, another one of these boxes. Really, a key doesn't work? What kind of key do you need, then? Try the other ones out. I highly doubt it's the other ones. No? Okay, then. Something's got to give. This is kind of a mystery. Okay, maybe there's a key we find for that box. Because I don't think we can go this way. I was wrong. Okay, I can go back. That's good. That's good to know. So what we're going to wind up doing is uh, exploring this next, er I guess, the entire area. I like that it's outside, but I also the outskirts kind of can be trippy sometimes. This is an altar. Oh, we're actually going back around the other... That's so cool. So the beginning area is still kind of part of the game in a good way. Okay, that makes sense. That is really awesome. Iron insignia key. Yeah, okay, that's... The well back there. Six wing and unborn key. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's awesome. It all kind of ties together. I like that. There you are. I had a feeling you would pop up here. It was all worthless. Is that so? I assume you've picked up something of value. Not sure if it's a value, but... Why... You have your daughter right in your own hands. What are you saying? Take a closer look. That flask seems to contain her head. No. What? Roses. Don't say another word. This. This is impossible. This just can't be. Your daughter's essence is still intact. Her powers are truly unique. Oh. Who could even do this? She can be saved, you know. Saved? From this? Are you insane? There's a house with a red chimney on the western side of the village. Go and seek out the man who lives there. Then we can continue our conversation. Quit holding out and get to the damn point! You don't have to trust my words. But do you have any better options? <sighs> Your choice. The customer is always right. After all. He'll pay you if I find out this is a lie. <laughs> Fucking joker. Find the house with the red chimney, just like that note said. 
Get a typewriter, let's oh, see what he's got. Good. I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. Alright, so he currently has... Oh, wow. And his sniper parts are expensive, look at that. I remember the sniper in 4 was very, very strong. We can also upgrade our inventory, which I don't think I quite need that just yet. Let me sell some stuff first, if I can even do that. 25,000. I wonder if you get anything for keeping these. Because I, I kind of wanted to keep them just to have them, but it's kind of weird, I guess. I oh, I want to keep them. Dimitrescu. Beautiful even in death. Ooh. That waistline. Yes. Do the shotgun upgrade right there. Here's my only issue with the... So I've been using the Wesker pistol, right? The only issue is... It doesn't make any sense for me to keep using it if it's actually going to be worse than this one if I upgrade this one. But the thing is, I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, I want to increase the power. Let me see what I can probably prioritize here. To be alive. First thing we're going to do is buy... Uh, let's see. Buy one of those just to keep it safe. Um, ammo. You can only get up to a certain point anyways. Same for these. Let's go ahead and get that as well. <laughs> Sniper rifle ammo. Same as that. Pipe bombs seem to be really, really good. Uh, I like having pipe bombs. Mine's also really, really good. I'm going to buy the pipe bomb. <laughs> All right. Let's upgrade some stuff. Uh, 10,000 for this. Got to do it. Shotgun's strong in this area. Definitely going to be necessary. Do I double down on this? I don't know if I should. I got two upgrades already. The recoil compensator and the high capacity mag. These two plus that. Let's do it. One moment, please. Level three. Okay. Let me then... Please come again. I guess we're going to make the... Because the Samurai's Edge, a powerful customized... I don't... Since I don't know if it's worth it or not. I don't know, guys. You know what I just realized? My shortcuts... Do I really need the knife on a shortcut? I don't think I do. I, I still think this is probably going to be better. Ah, uh, yes, yes. Let me see. 17,000 more. Uh, pipe bomb recipe. Let's get that. I saw you eyeing that one. Make mines, I guess I could also get that. I almost I don't want to like... The scope of the... Ra like, I don't think that's necessary... Reduces the sway. I mean, that's all about your eye-hand coordination, I guess. I ultimately wanted to increase the power of each thing. And that's what I want to do. Uh -huh. So, and I've done that. Rate of fire, all that stuff. I can change that stuff later on. But power is the most important thing. I'm going to save my game now. Till next, next we meet. Because yeah, anytime you go to break something, I a lot of times, most of the enemies, if I do damage, and then I run up. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's stronger. I wish I could test it out, but they both seem to be about the same thing. Both handguns are equally good. So we got two other areas. What does this area go to? Won't fit. Hmm. What kind of four-winged unborn key? So that's not the same type of key I currently have. Oh, it's, I just got the winged one. Okay. Yeah, because if you break something, it automatically pulls out the knife anyways. Uh, the only thing is, I don't know if this is stronger than the other. Yeah, we're back in the original area. Let's get it. It's actually kind of cool to be back here. Not going to lie. All right, we have a lock pick, which I think we only have one. We have two. Okay, I can go to this house and get this. My only issue with going back around is I know for a fact that... There are going to be... Those beasts. Or lichens or whatever you want to call them. Here it is. Seven shotgun shells? That's so much. That's actually a lot. What in the world? I just feel like this pistol looks so much smaller and weaker than this one. But I got all these upgrades for it, so I don't know what's... What's better? I'll try it out for a little bit, I guess. I haven't even searched all this. What in the world? Hold on. Let's go back inside really quick. 
Uh, already read that note before. Why is it still red in here? It's got to be on the roof or something. Mm, let's see. Look around back here, maybe. Anytime something is red, I'm like, what am I doing wrong? Gotta be on the roof or something. Let's see. This is so, like... It's just weird to me, because I'm trying to figure out, like, where whatever it is is at. Currently searching. It's gotta be something I'm missing. I thought maybe shooting this down would, like, reveal something, but that... I don't want to waste bullets. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, we're getting out of here. Pretty sure you might even see what I missed back there, but it is what it is. All right, so right now we're going to head back, I think, over here. If I had to guess. Can I open this? No? Okay, it's still locked. Very cool to be back over here, though. Well, if there's anything for this. Maiden of War. We also have Iron Insignia Key for back there as well. I vote we go... Hold on. Did we already go down through here? I don't remember going down here before. Teddy Bear? Hmm... <clears throat> Yeah, I don't remember any of this stuff. It's still not all of it. That should be everything. What? Let's check out the teddy bear. I see the fireplace, I think, is what it's going to be. Uh, oh, it's just a valuable. Okay. Yo, check it out. What is that? Now nah, it's blue. We're going to go. I just feel like I like this pistol better. I, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. We have uh, another lock pick we can use back there. These are just normal locks I can use a bolt cutter. Save point back over in that area as well. Uh, we're going to have to go behind us. I think it's like back up in here. Take, take a right. 